it's welcome back to one minute resilience. It's 60 seconds to try and turbocharge us and keep us strong for the next few days ahead. And today we're gonna to look at imposter syndrome. Imposter syndrome means that deep down, I feel like a fraud or I don't feel worthy of the position that I'm in or the status or recognition that I have right now. And this is actually something that I'm discovering is quite common to a lot of staff. A lot of people are saying that unless I am on the front line delivering hands-on care to COVID positive patients, then I am not contributing to this fight. And the Thursday evening 8pm round of applause, that doesn't really apply to me. That's nonsense, guys. And let me tell you for why. Every single role in the National Health Service contributes either directly or indirectly to the care of patients. It doesn't matter whether your facilities, finance, estates, workforce, medicine, therapies, nursing, you get the general idea. All of us make a difference. Every single one of us. Ask yourself this. Has my working practice had to change in the last month? If the answer to that question is yes, then you are contributing to this, guys. You've had to change what you do. You've had to be faster, smarter, stronger. You've had to evolve to meet the needs of the patient on the front line. Doesn't matter who you are, where you work, that's why you're changing. You have earned that round of applause. Be proud, accept it. You are worth it. Do not let imposter syndrome beat you. I'm proud of you as always, guys. You're doing an amazing job. We will win this and we will win it together. Be proud, rock on.